what you've got to remember is it's quite it's quite funny because it is the 21st century but still we just have sound and we just have pictures and so those are the two things that you've got to tell a story with and sometimes people forget that you can tell a story with just pictures and you can tell a story with just words i think sometimes you can use a person's interview out of vision with certain images that will give it greater impact than if they were telling you just straight into camera. You can just use images and no interview or just music and again that will move the story on or convey what you want to say. I made a cutting edge documentary about missing people and I filmed somebody gone missing and then they returned. And in the edit, we struggled a lot with how we got to their return because it was just, I was going to go to the house and they were there and, you know, do an interview. So I'd already done that. And in the end, we just, without any commentary introducing it, we brought up a voice that you hadn't heard. And the voice was apologetic and regretful. And eventually we put some images over that of just kind of people walking through cities and abstract images and then eventually we brought the voice into vision and revealed that that was the person who had gone missing who had returned. You need a lateral mind is what you need to tell a good story.